Hello, everybody. How are you guys doing? Chow, I want to talk about how JT is still upset with Glow, Chow. Glow said a few things and left it alone. JT ain't left it alone since, Chow. She's at one of her most, I would say, successful shows, and she decided to address Glow Rilla's comments. You know how Glow said, don't make me pop up at one of those backyard barbecues, right? So I guess... um. JT's decided to say that, hey, it ain't whack. Um, I, I don't know who said it was whack because I don't think that that's what Glow said. Glow didn't say that your, um, I guess, barbecues are lacking luster or anything of that nature. She just said she was going to pull up. You know what I'm saying? Because you said that you were pending a, a police warrant or whatever, a police mugshot. So y'all was going to fight. She wasn't saying it was good nor bad. She was acknowledging that that's what it was. And you're co-signing and saying that that's exactly what it is. Um, and it, that it's not whack. And nobody called it whack. Nobody said that it was a bad thing for you to have a backyard barbecue. That's just where you're at right now. But I don't know. I mean, she wasn't saying it like a good thing either. She was saying that she was going to pull up and it was going to be what it was going to be. Now, ever since then, you have not been able to get it off your mind. And I don't know, maybe because you're ashamed, maybe because you don't like the fact that that's where you're at currently in your career. But it's not a great thing. and It's not a bad thing either. I mean, honestly, I think it's a good thing. I'm, I don't care how other people feel. I think it's a good thing because... A lot of people wish that they had that turnout currently in their career. A lot of underground artists, up and coming artists wish that they had that opportunity. OK, that's just where you're at. You know, take pride in that. I don't know. But she's like upset and going, you know, back and forth and, you know, diff different things as far as at the um, shows and saying, you know, hey, I ain't had no whack, you know, backyard barbecue or whatever. She She's saying what she's saying. I don't know. I'm gonna play that clip at the end. But I don't know. I, I think that the fact that she's making it sound more as a negative thing than um, I think Glow did. Glow was just saying that that's where she was going to pull up and fight you at. She wasn't. I mean, whatever it is, you know, you add if it's good or bad. She wasn't down talking it i would say she just was saying that she that's where she would have to pull up at and you are further in your career you should be further in your career have more hits than glow you know what i'm saying and the fact that you're still performing at those type of small venues maybe that's the key key in it you know maybe that's the bad feeling in it maybe that's what where the side eye going you know what i'm saying i don't know but i think you're still speaking about it you still giving it light especially in a moment to where you should be focusing on the crowd focusing on your audience focusing on the people that came out in your city to show you love that should be your focus who cares what Glow says? Why are you bringing Glow up or bringing anything that anybody else has said to you up at this show where people are here to show you love? Show them love. Focus on them. I don't even understand why, I don't know, too many fe female artists or artists in general focus on the opposition, the ops, when they should be taking pride in the moment and enjoying the fact that people are there to show them love and be there for them and be there to see them. I don't know. This is my opinion. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Um, I got some stuff up for y'all. It's a lot of y'all. 